Fun Facts proudly presents the BAC Mono Supercar. It was introduced in 2011. I believe it was brought to the market in 2013. And it, it is here today in 2022 and let's pray that it goes beyond. So without further ado, let's get started now. I just wanted to point out one of the highlights while gathering some of these photos that the BAC supercar is an actual police car in um, uh, Dubai. So there's a couple photos that depict that. You might be able to find some videos on YouTube that show the actual supercar in action. And I thought that was a pretty cool thing to talk about. Okay. I'm gonna start off by saying I'm biased. <clears throat> This car is freaking amazing. I've been watching videos on YouTube and it just had to be, I just had to make a video. So here it goes. I'm reading from uh, the Bach, excuse me, the BAC mono.com, the BAC story. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna go through some of the highlights here of the, uh, the website and um, here we go. So, the BAC story is one of the remarkable success, how an unconventional driving t dream became reality in Britain before taking all four corners of the world by storm. First launched in 2011, the BAC Mono is the realization of two brothers, the vision of a road vehicle that offers the most authentic and pure driving experience possible while implementing the very latest racing technology. BAC's founding brothers, Neil and Ian Briggs, were indoctrinated into the world of cars from an early age and quickly developed a love for the industry that continued into adulthood. They always saw themselves creating their own car and bringing it to the market one day but set about getting the necessary professional experience to ensure they had the perfect platform from which to build. After graduating from their respective university courses, the brothers set up their own design engineering consultancy with Neil leading engineering activities and Ian heading up the design elements. The company was commissioned to work on major automotive projects with likes of Porsche, Mercedes, Smart, AMG, Maybach, Ford, and Bentley. But they also gained valuable experience with smaller brands too. While enhancing their company and personal reputations in delivering for OEMs, learning vital skills and businesses approaches in the process, Neil and Ian worked out their niche and saw a gap in the market that they believed simply had to be filled. A single-seater road legal vehicle that focuses purely on the person behind the wheel and is totally uncompromised. Amen. Track days alongside Neil and Ian's friends, including the now BAC senior designer Guy Harvey in two-seater cars taught the brothers that <clears throat> even any car with a passenger is compromised in some way, shape, or form. But how far could they take their creation? Could they create a race car for the road that can be regarded as the ultimate piece of sporting equipment for the sport of driving an A to A vehicle rather than an A to B. After years of meticulous planning, designing, engineering, and manufacturing, Mono was unleashed on the world at the Retro Classics show Stuttgart as a totally unique proposition that caused shockwaves across the industry. Never had there been such a stunning supercar that combined racing tech and the latest automotive innovations with genuine track pedigree on a road ability. Now Mono has been exported to over 40 territories around the globe. 
broken a whole host of performance records on the track and is widely considered as the best driver's car around. All of which started from two car enthusiast brothers and their lofty ambitions to bring driving purity to the world. In terms of manufacturing, BAC has been responsible for a number of world firsts in the car industry that have brought about impressive performance and weight saving enhancements on the mono. BAC was the first company in the world to develop a hybrid carbon composite wheels in collaboration with British performance wheel manufacturer Dymag. Plus, it scooped another world's first when it became the first manufacturer to develop a car featuring panels incorporating the use of graphene, an innovative and lightweight material. But the brand remains true to its British roots. In fact, of the 1,250 bespoke components used to build mono from 100 suppliers, 95% are based in the UK, 45% meanwhile are from local companies in Liverpool and the Northwest region. BAC continues to break new ground around the world and win new fans every day, but its ethos remains the same. Challenge and convention, challenge convention, and provide the ultimate driving experience on both the road and track. Um, I have to tell you, I can't say I've been more impressed with any vehicle in my life right now other than the BAC. I mean, you can love Ferrari and I'm a Porsche guy, come on. I'm a Porsche guy. But when two brothers set out to build this one-seater road and racing machine, it just is amazing. You can watch the videos of this particular car and it'll just blow your mind. It's so sweet. So if you've come this far into the video, I hope you're enjoying the photos. If you like the video, please give us a thumbs up. It really helps our channel. If you like our channel, we're going to be doing more videos on supercars from all over the world. And we're so happy that we can bring you this BAC supercar today. So we'd like to thank you for your time. And we wish you a great day and always be safe.
Belgium. Jumbo. 